Ryan Reynolds teases Green Lantern and Zack Snyder's Justice League. That's right, guys. After yesterday, talking and everything. And, uh, oh, man, I totally spelled. I knew I, I, knew I was going to mess up. Too many R's. Okay, there you go. Much better. <laughs> Anyways, drinking water, of course. So, yes, a day after I was like, I started like, you know what? I'm going to go. I'm going to I'm going to have my own my own scoop. Just kidding. Not scoop, uh, but my own little opinion on on the Ryan Reynolds thing. And I pretty much said that I think he's going to get his Deadpool movie before he gets anything else. Yeah, that's what I that's what I'm going to do. And then, of course, you know, Mr. Garza was in the uh, was in the live chat and he, uh, of course, uh, time stamped and released uh, the clips were of me saying that after, of course, Ryan Reynolds teased the uh, <laughs> teased that he could be coming back. Ryan Reynolds laughing at, yeah, totally, totally laughing at me. I don't know, man. I know. Of course, is Garza watching? Is he? He hasn't said anything, so I wonder. I wonder if he is. That's totally fine. I still stand by it. I still stand by it, okay? Obviously, you guys know exactly what, what's happening right here because it's what blew up the internet right here. So. So Ryan Reynolds, of course, this was at 3.38 a.m. my time, okay? So this was really early in the morning. I woke up to all this madness this morning. But, of course, he says, I'm not playing Hawkman in Black Adam. Boom. I mean, I've obviously, when it came to that exclusive scoop, whatever the hell you want to call it, it's ridiculous. And But, you know, we could talk about that. I mean, whatever. But anyways, although generally I do, generally do whatever the hell The Rock tells me to do, I would, uh, however, love to be in Zack Snyder's Justice League movie. I've heard I may already be in it. Hashtag Snyder Cut. Now, he could be trolling, and a lot of people might think that he's trolling. I don't know. A lot of people, there's some people out there that think, see, you know, he could be trolling, and he's just like, oh, he's just playing with the fandom, this, that, and this, blah, blah, blah. But it's just the way that this is worded. Kind of throws you off a little bit. And yes, Ben Everett, you're right there. You're right there. You're the first one. Yes, drink some gin. I will drink some gin. Maybe I'll pick some of that up this weekend, Scott. See what happens. I just don't know if I want to drink it straight. Gin straight is pretty uh, pretty gnarly. Anyways, um, so the way that he worded this right here, the way it goes out, because obviously he tags the rock, which is great, and and then he um, hashtags Snyder Cut, okay? He says Zack Snyder's Justice League, and then hashtags Snyder Cut. Now, we got to remember, guys, we got to remember that 100% Ryan Reynolds... And his marketing team are fucking awesome. Okay, they are fantastic. Obviously, with uh, with his uh, aviation gin commercials and everything, um, he's done really great commercials. I mean, look what he did. He he, he got the Peloton girl, the, you know, on that that stupid Peloton bike commercial that was happening over Christmas time, and how cheesy it was, and how there was so much backlash and controversy around that stupid that stupid commercial. And then all of a sudden, he was like. They got her and they, they had like a whole fucking, you know, a whole commercial wrapped around her, you know, of course, drinking at the bar and just having this, <laughs> this shocked look on her face, which was absolutely fantastic. And not to mention, he already he's already made fun of Justice League, pretty much. I mean, we already saw that, too, where where he had a mustache and he takes a drink and all of a sudden the mustache is gone and looks ridiculous. And he like shakes his head and falls off screen. That 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 commercial absolutely cracked me up. Absolutely cracked me up. Yeah, I should probably do some gin and tonic. I could probably do a gin and tonic. Gin and tonic's pretty good. So, um, so of course, he tweeted this out, and that got everybody just all riled up, and uh, we were all just like, holy shit, what the hell is going on? <laughs> Ryan Reynolds literally tweeted out, Zack Snyder Justice League and hashtag the Snyder Cut. So, and then, just to take things a step further, we're going to watch this together. Just to, take, make, just to take things a step further, he goes, here's the secret Reynolds cut of Green Lantern you all haven't been waiting for. I love that. In order to make it as great as possible, we made some ju uh, judicious cuts. So here we go. Let's watch this together. Goddamn, that's beautiful. Beautiful. The Green Lantern. <laughs> Find out soon enough. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Tom Cruise, and there he is. 
What the hell? So crazy, but you know, I mean, the fact that Tom Cruise makes an appearance, cameo in this, it's freaking fantastic. The thing is, though, it's like somebody put this together, okay? This wasn't just like stuff that was ripped out of wherever and just put together on the, someone's phone. I mean, look at this. Somebody actually put this together, put it all together. It's just, it's all very odd. It's all very odd if you think about it. I mean, what do we, I mean, what is he doing here? Is he really telling us something or is he just doing the ultimate troll right now? Okay. I mean, obviously it could, it's Ryan Reynolds. So who's, who knows? But like we've been talking about, um, like I've said, what's going on, Danny, like I've said before is, you know, he's expressed interest in coming back to the Green Lantern role for a while. I'm talking about past five, six, who knows how many years it's just, it's been a while that he's expressed interest. He's been wanting to come back. And the fact that it doesn't seem like anything's happening over in the Deadpool world, even though that's where I started, I, you know what I think happened like over the weekend, I, I think I just love him in the, uh, in the Deadpool role, which I have a Deadpool picture right here so much that I'm like, you know what? I actually would want him to come back more as Deadpool than Green Lantern. I had one of those moments and it bled into yesterday and I st I'm still like that too. And uh, go ahead and uh, timestamp that and uh, release that clip right there. Um, <laughs> Tom Cruise. Yeah. I, I've always said Tom Cruise is way too old to play Hal Jordan. I, I mean, even though he doesn't look it and he'd be perfectly fine. I just don't think, eh, they needed someone just a little bit younger. I mean, come on. But, um, yeah. So I think, I think like over the weekend, I was just kind of thinking about wanting another Deadpool movie. And that's why I was like, mm, I wonder if like Feige and all them after all this is said and done, are they just going to just all of a sudden just show up and be like, Hey, no, you're, you're with us. Here's your movies right there. Pretty please do not leave. Do not leave us. And then of course, Dwayne Johnson ends up joining the fun, which is great. So we have both Ryan Reynolds and Dwayne, the rock Johnson talking about Zack Snyder's justice league guys. Can you believe this? Who would have thought we would have been here right now? Right. Okay. You are playing Hawkman and that's that you're also Deadpool green lantern. When you want, when you want, because uh, you own the intellectual property, you're in the Zack Snyder justice league movie. And you're also Kevin Hart's dad, like in real life as per your blood test. So there you go. And it'd be awesome. If Kevin Hart did Kevin Hart, Kevin Hart didn't say anything, right? Of course, Kevin Hart didn't say anything. Yeah, I know. He's no, I think he's just too old to play Hal, man. I just, I don't know. To me, he's just, uh, he's too old to play Hal. Like, I get it. The guy doesn't fucking age, probably because he eats like, I don't know, he eats like fetuses or something. I don't know what he does. I don't know what 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 goes on in uh, Scientology and stuff like that. I don't know what keeps him young. He runs like a motherfucker. See, that's the thing, though. Tom Cruise, he runs. That's his. That's his thing. That's his trait. Okay, that's his biggest attribute when it comes to being an action star. He ain't going to be running in space. Okay, out in the cosmos, he ain't going to be running in space. You know, so there you go. Why do we need him? No. But anyways, so very interesting, guys. The fact that we have both Dwayne Johnson and Ryan Reynolds talking about Zack Snyder's Justice League. Awesome stuff. So if this is all coordinated, so basically if this, if every little bit of this is coordinated, which it very well could be, or it could just be one big elaborate troll that Ryan Reynolds is doing. But this, if this is all coordinated, Snyder knows about this. Snyder has been talking to, to Ryan Reynolds. And I guess we'll see what happens. I don't know. Um, what's her name? I guess we can go to Grace, you know, see what she had to say about it. She's already said stuff about it. Uh, let me pull up her tweeting right here. She tweeted out today. She don't really talk about it too much. By the way, that freaking uh, explosion in Beirut, man, that is crazy. Crazy stuff that happened. What? Let's see. Uh, hmm, remember tweeting about Hirsch, right? I don't know. I can't find her tweet now. Was it today? What's today? <laughs> I can't even know. August 3rd. What the hell? So here we go. All right. So here's her tweet right here. Talk, let's see what Grace is talking about right here. Yeah, we'll pull up Garz's girl. Garz's girl. Garz's woman right here. Um, DC fandom can't get here soon enough. Told you first. Told you first. Uh, respond Green Lantern. Re Green Lantern. Also told you he's not Hawkman. As I also said, Ryan Reynolds is a marketing genius and would be a huge asset to the Snyder Cut, which this tweet itself shows. Clever, clever man. So obviously she's heard a lot of things. 
I don't know how much she's heard. She's also said, she's also stated, and this is what I actually like about Grace is the fact that she'll wait until the news is out there before she does a video, even though she tweets about it. It's kind of funny. <laughs> I do find it kind of funny that she'll be like, no, no, I'm not going to talk about it till, uh, Till, uh, you know, the, the information's out there. I'm not going to do a video, but she'll tweet about it, <laughs> of course. But, um, yeah, it's whatever. That's just her style. But I but I like the fact that she's going to wait for it. I mean, I guess if she's hinting at anything, if she knows anything, it's going to be a DC fandom. I don't know. And maybe Reynolds is just... It's going to be interesting to see how Reynolds follows up, up with this. Because um, if he follows up with something else then it's pretty much going to be a set deal. I mean, basically what she's also said too, I think she's also mentioned is that, um, yeah, I don't think so. I think she kind of break now, but she also mentioned too. I think she mentioned it in her replies when she was replying at people. Um, that's a fake account place for me, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. She mentioned something about, oh yeah. Eh, okay. Well, I mean, she said something like this, like he's not definitely cast, uh, she's just a name. He's just a name I've heard as a finalist. Is that who's she talking about? Oh, uh, talk about Army Hammer. Okay, never mind. But yeah, he says, I'm hearing there's a chance, a chance she'll still get Army Hammer in the DCU. So she's saying that he's going to play Hawkman, maybe? I didn't see that tweet, but that's going to be interesting. So she's hearing also Army Hammer as well. I don't know. Remember, let's see. And okay, right here she goes, I've heard as of now. There is no deal like that, nor is there, uh, nor is there one being actively pursued. Uh, is that what he's oh, talking about? Affleck. Okay, so still talking about Affleck not being that. So she thinks she's saying DC fandom at the earliest. So there you go. I mean, it's basically going to be that. Hey, vodka chugger, what's going on? If um, I don't know if you covered this, but Reynolds' banner on Twitter is a bottle of aviation. Could it be a subtle hint since H. Jordan is a. <laughs> Thank you.